All right, we're about to connect to the radio graffiti line. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's do it now. Here it is. All right. Are we are we online or what the hell? Do I have to change the settings? Look, unfortunately, uh, I have to do a bunch of shit. This is all new shit. So, um, here, let me see this. Can we hear? No, 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 no. That's not it. No, that's not it. All right, hold on just one second. Let's go ahead and do it like this. All right, there it is. There it is. There it is. All right, shut up. All right, sorry about that. This is all new shit, dude. All right, I mean, I have to... I threw all this together. You know, it's a new computer. You got a new fucking a mixer, new mics, new, new fucking new everything, dude. All right, anyway, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get to Radio Graffiti right now. How about 816 Radio Graffiti? Hey, mate! Hey there, Ghostler. I'm really glad that you came back for the ghost show. I'm just here to remind you that, well, you know, sometimes it's a little hard out here as a Jewish man, and I'd appreciate it if you donate to the ADL sometimes. Some of your big donations that you get here. Anyway, thanks, Ghost, and, uh, fuck Ah, uh, you fucking piece of shit. Look! I'm starting Radio Graffiti. There's no need to get fucking racial, all right? All right, you guys are taking shit way overboard. That's enough. Jesus Christ. Do you see what I got to fucking put up with, dude? Are you fucking kidding me, man? All right, where are we at here? Can we continue? Uh, How about area code uh, 617, Radio Graffiti? Ghost calls San Antonio's Z Gay Bath House. What's going on, dude? How you been, man? Hey, we're calling. But hey, it's Andre. How the hell? How you been? I haven't heard from you in a minute. I was wondering, you know, if uh, if my John Holmes fifteen and a half scared you away a little bit. <laughs> I don't remember who can you remind me who this is. <laughs> my name is Nick. Yes, but I don't remember your John Holt or what what you called it. <laughs> oh my God. I'm just going to put it like this, okay? 200 bucks. You and me tonight, body slapping. What do you think? Uh, I'm a little bit worth more than $200. Oh, Sorry. my God. Uh, I've got a 12 and a half inch cock. Oh, that sounds lovely. Is it uncircumcised? Uh, yes. Oh, sounds nice. Are you going to come by and show it off? If I go balls deep in your bussy, uh, have you properly douched, anal douched your ass enough to where I'm not going to have any shit particles on my schlong, okay? Oh, my God. Yeah, that sounds very disgusting. I'm a real fucking man with a big fucking schlong, and I can go all night long. Ooh, I like the sound of that. But you know what I'd like to do? I'd like to fucking just ram it upside your fucking shithole, or I just fucking ram it so hard you ain't gonna be shitting right for a week, and then pull it out, and then have you clean it, baby, with your fucking mouth. And you better clean it good. You understand that, bitch? Oh, well, that, that sounds pretty enticing. Oh my I'm God. I'm the kind of guy that'll stick a fucking ten and a half inch cock right up inside your holes. Well, I thought you said it was twelve and a half. Nine and a half. Oh no, and now you're talking to Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, I gotta ask you, sir, have you been here before? Uh, uh, no. <laughs> well, if you ever have the courage to come and see what the guy's post is all about, you are open. Uh, you will have you. Uh, <laughs> you don't want you to have hurt anybody with your big 12. Or nine and a half inch cock. You want to fuck at nine and a half going up that fucking ass? <laughs> well, honestly, I prefer something in the double digits, but I know there's some guys here that would say, please handle a nine for you. Uh, you guys are, are literally showing anal camel toe. You are so goddamn fruity tonight. <laughs> well, I would love to get our conversation, but I do have some guests that just walked in sir, so please come by. Like, you want a pig? Or something? <laughs> <laughs> Who's doing this? Okay, so fucking you have one suck it! Suck it out of my ass! <laughs> what the fuck? Take this shit off, dude. Who's doing this, dude? 
All right. All right. That was kind of funny because the gay guy noticed was very attentive about the size of the girth. It went from 15 and a half to 12 and a half to 11 and 10. <laughs> it's like, oh, my. I, I thought it was 12. I, I thought it was 10. Oh, my God. Please stop doing that, dude. That was almost pretty realistic. And by the way, that wasn't AI. Uh, that was old shit that I used to say on the Dateline. That's why everybody wants me to do Dateline again, so that they can get stupid fucking goddamn splices like that. <sighs> All right. That was kind of funny, but still, I don't really appreciate that it's me being the butt end, no pun intended, of the fucking joke. All right? Jesus Christ, why don't you just come by and show it off? Uh, how about 337, Radio Graffiti? How's it going, Ghost? What's going on? Not much, just uh, hanging out, texting my girl right now, trying to get her to call in. Oh, uh, yeah, this GTR? The one and only. Hey, man, all right, yeah, you said that you and your girl, y'all, are now, you got her into the True Capitals radio show and the Ghost show. That's pretty cool, man. Yeah, man, she's particularly fond of the, the Art Ham and the Anime Con video. All right, get this fucking idiot. I, I thought you were being cool and shit, and then when you said Art Ham, and that's all, that's all you had to say to me for me to want to puke up nasty chicken grease and corn oil and cream of wheat with five-day-old cereal and stomach plasma. All right, let's take some names instead. How about some fucking names? How about Haywood's Colostomy Bag Radio Graffiti? Fucking shit off, for fuck's sake, man! Fucking ear rape, asshole! Jesus Christ. All right, how about autistic numb ass radio graffiti? The fuck? This goes out to the long chat. Ghost of Majima. What the hell? For all my supporters. I'm tired of being a ham bone sex toy. Feeling so dirty, lost under the shack chair. I don't know why you just won't stop. <laughs> me till you make my walls fall out. Every nub that I slob is another Charge on your it's a fucking record. Ghost did me. He forced me to dress up like him again. Goodbye, then he be no shit. I don't like this. Please just stop. Ghost, you stop finger blasting like Brigitte did to me. Oh, you piece of shit. Turn it. Shut that fucking. No. No. No! No! Ah! Fucking stupid piece of shit! Look! I get it, alright? We're supposed to have radio graffiti. We're having radio graffiti now! Dude, that's fucking disgusting, man. Is that fucking Helmet Boy? That sounded like fucked up fucking Helmet Boy, dude. <laughs> Jesus fucking... Get this fucking crap out of here! All right, give me another drink. I need another fucking drink here. Uh, all right, uh, let's see. How about Ghost Peace Radio Graffiti? Ghost of Majima. Prolapse Pete. And I see you pee, Radio Graffiti. Money, success, fame, brodies. Thomas Alvin, the king of the tarts, obtained this and everything else the world has to offer. And his dying words drove countless souls to his show. You want a TGS? You can have it. I stream in one place. Now you just have to watch it. These words lured men to the ghost show, pursuing dreams greater than they ever dared to imagine. This is the time known as the Great Troll Era. Come on and bring the mom. All your shekels of steam. Together we will find everything that we're looking for. The ghost show. Retards left behind, they will only slow us down. Your heart will be your guide. 
call right in and take the helm. That legendary show that the end of the day reveals it's only legendary till someone makes it real. Through it all, through all the trouble, time, through the heartache, and through the pain, know that I will be there to stand by you! Just like I know you'll stand by me! So come on board and bring along all your shickles to steed! Together we will find the fake rage that we're looking for! There's always room for you! If you want to make him cans, go slur, go slur, Satyu! Go slur! Fucking piece of shit. You want radio graffiti for this? Good fucking goddamn fucking radio graffiti for this fucking goddamn fucking stupid fucking bullshit! Ah, get the shit out of here! Is that what you idiots want? You want radio graffiti for this bullshit? I'm fucking tired. I'm already tired, dude. I'm already fucking tired of this fucking stupid radio graffiti bullshit. One more fucking stupid dumbass fucking bullshit like that, and I'm doing a video. Do you understand me? I'm going back to numbers here, all right? 319 radio graffiti. Hashino, now it's one and center for the purposes of YouTube, but to describe her, she is... Very, very, very fussy, okay? And they turn yes. the jiggle physics up to a thousand. Like, I'm pretty sure yes. her organs are coated with some jiggle physics. I mean, she is thicker than a bowl of oatmeal, okay? And my point is, addressing a lot of these people angry about this, you have to understand whether she uh, her a large breasted character or not, I it is not surprising that a lot of people, men and women included, would like it. All right, look, you sound like you're calling from the inside of an ass, all right? I mean, get it straight. I can't believe there's still Obama phones. You know, you got fucking people giving away fucking iPhones, every fucking goddamn carrier out here, and they still got this bullshit. Uh, how about 915, Radio Graffiti? Cheers to Haywood, cheers to Helmet Boy, and fuck... You fucking piece of shit. Look, uh, look... If you're going to say something, that's one thing. Stop being a racist piece of trash. All right, stop being a racist piece of garbage. Here, give me a drink. Uh, all right. Um, how about recent lost episode of TCR, Radio Graffiti? Oh! How bad dragon, Radio Graffiti? Yeah, as you can tell by this intro, it's... Hey, Proud Bad Dragon, a.k.a. Scuff Cookie Monster. I'm just going to tell everybody right now, I have this lost episode of True Catalyst Radio that was quickly deleted off YouTube because Ghost was going to get in trouble from it, and he knows. In fact, I quickly downloaded it, and I have this particular clip that's kind of funny, and it proves everything that's Ghost. All right, so here it is. True Capless Radio, the lost episode. One of them, but the most recent one. Here it is. I am here to present one problem I have with America. It's the overpopulation problem. Now, how do we eliminate this? Now, rather than reciting some headline I found off of a news site, like I normally do and call it prognostication, I have my own solution. One that may come off as a bit below the belt to certain people. One that might come off as me being a tad biased toward a certain type of people. I am going to just say this shit, kicking all the out of the country, having America be a completely country. We're going to kick all the we're going to kick all the out. We're going to kick all the out and we're going to kill all the uh, all these were responsible for enemy. All these races are responsible for special education classes that only autistic tards partake in. And I think they turned our men trans and gay men should be the only Americans to live in this country. I mean, you guys are, this doesn't concern you. I mean, 
this should concern everybody, for heaven's sake. Uh, anyway, I have this weed from the Mexican kid who sells candy apples around the corner. Thank God I am not on Vaughn.Live, otherwise Mark is going to kill me. I am friends with that Mexican kid, by the way, and his name is Cesar Lopez. That should tell you that I am a melting pot of friendship, not a racist groomer who likes younger people than yours, truly. See, Ghost has double standards and is a complete hypocrite and contradicts himself every time. Plus, he is a racist. He is a groomer. Oh, yeah. And I think he's coming right now. Every fucking time, man. Every fucking time! Hey, Ghost, um, could you tell everyone the truth? I mean, everyone knows you're a racist and a groomer. All right, that's it! All right, I'm tired of it, man! You know, do I really want to tell Mark on you? I mean, you're pretty much fucked anyway. I'm Vaughn I Live. This is such a That is real audio. How bad dragon? Get that fucking stupid shit! You son of a bitch, man! God damn it! You son of a bitch! <sighs> All right, man. I think I'm. The, I, I gotta. I, I don't know, man. I gotta. I gotta take a break or something, man. This is fucked up. I can't believe you people are doing this shit to me, man. It's the first ghost show back, man. It's the first ghost show back. Jesus Christ! All right. <sighs> I don't even know if I should continue with Radio Graffiti after that fucking bullshit, for heaven's sake. Look, let's take some more numbers here, all right? How about that? Maybe it'll be a little different. Anyway, let's continue here. How about uh, area code 470, Radio Graffiti? <laughs> Testify against Trump in Georgia. Ghost did... Yeah, fucking scuffed Yoda. First of all, stick your dumb, stupid 78-pound head up your fucking mutant ass, first of all. And secondly, all right, don't even say Trump on this show, all right? Because then I'm going to get political, and people don't want old ghosts to get political on the ghost show, all right? They just expect tomfoolery, and that's all there is to it, all right? Jesus Christ. Uh, how about uh, 858 uh, Radio Graffiti? Boy, how are they goes? How are you? What's going on? This is Hank Hill. Really? It's Hank Hill? Yes, sir. How are you getting on tonight with your show, Ghost? Uh, I'm barely getting on. Let's put it that way, man. I mean, I got these fucking people coming at me, you know, every way from Sunday. You know what I mean? I can understand that, Ghost. I wanted to talk to you about one of these trolls who's been calling into your show. All right, who's that? He goes by the name, I uh, hope I get this right, it's uh, Ghosto uh, Majima. Am I getting that right? Uh, yeah, I got Ghosto Majima. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. Well, Ghost, he's been grooming people in your Thunderdome. He's been talking to that kid wearing the helmet for a few years now. They've been trading pictures of their testicles for the last few years, and... I have a reason to believe that they were trading pictures of their anatomy by the time that this helmet kid was under the age of 18. Oh, yeah? You got proof of that? I have some Discord logs. I have an account in that server where they're, where they're hanging out with the cat kid and that Schwami child. Oh, my God. Are you talking about Ard Hammond, server? Because Ard Hammond seems to condone that type of, oh, yeah, well, separate the miners, ghost. I have reason to believe that that Ard Hamon kid may be a terrorist, ghost. Nah, he's too fat to be a fucking terrorist. Are you fucking kidding me? He's a terrorist at a fucking buffet. I wouldn't let that dude into a buffet if I was the manager of one, I'll tell you that. Anyway, ghost, that's about all I've got to say tonight. Would it be okay if some shout outs. All right, go ahead. Give some shout outs, man. Shout outs to Pinochet and the Red Mexican. Oh, the Red Mexican. All right, man. Cheers to you. 
It seems to me that, uh, you know, we got some implications going towards uh, Ghost Omajima and Helmet Boy's way. I you know, hope that's a troll. Uh, but anyway, let us continue, folks. We are on Radio Graffiti right now, so we are continuing on. Uh, how about uh, 909 Radio Graffiti? Uh, hey, Ghost, uh, you need to do two things. One, you need to unban Art Hammond, and two, you need to make up for scamming me out of my snake up the ass. Yeah, well, first of all, fuck you, and secondly, fuck you with a snake in the ass, you stupid, dumb fucking prick. How about 484 Radio Graffiti? Hey, Ghost, it's Winston Fujimori. Can you hear me? Oh, great. Yeah, yeah, just the prick I wanted to fucking talk to. That's great. All right, go ahead. What is it, Winston? Uh, I just wanted to apologize publicly again for pissing you off in our last few IC meetings. I know you said uh, I'm on, like, some kind of crazy drugs or something. Uh, I don't know. I, it was my birthday, and I'm not that crazy about my birthday, so I guess that's what's, what's going on. But, um... Ghost, I wanted to say, I, you, you know how you called the gun one time? Yeah. I think I might have another number for you to call. I have to get it first, but this one will be really, really big. Oh, uh, yeah? Yeah, definitely. I'm not going to say what it is like on the show with everyone here, so I'm just going to like cock tease you a bit, but I think I can get this number. But I mean, either way, uh, I just wanted to say cheers to you, Ghost. I'm like seven years deep, but um, I picked up some Stella Artois today. Yeah, I'm about five, you know, here's some five beers right now. I mean, but uh, I'm trying to pace myself because I have to do this fucking show. We're already seven hours and five minutes into the broadcast, so, you know, you know it is what it is. Wait, you only had five beers? Oh my god, what a lightweight. That's, that's typical of a European-style liberal. Oh, uh, uh, York shit. Dude, go fuck yourself, all right, you fucking stupid piece of shit. I got a fucking show to do, you fucking stupid, dumb, John Candy, Khalid Sheikh Mohammed hybrid-looking son of a bitch. Jesus fucking Christ. Do you see what I got to fucking put up with, man? How about Country Code 33, Radio Graffiti? I am a goddamn racist fuck. Shut up! <sighs> All right. Look, uh, if I continue to have this type of crap on Radio Graffiti, I'm going to have to do another video, man. I mean, I'm serious. I'm, I'm taking a lot of shit here. It's one of the first ghost shows back in a long fucking time. How about 956 Radio Graffiti? Hi, uh, buddy. Can you hear me? Yeah, what's up, man? Mate, you're fucking talking shit about Nick Fuentes. You got all this fucking pretty stuff. I want to show you a fucking poofter. Nick Fuentes is ten times straight at you. How, how do you answer for your entire show up to now? Well, I can't even fucking understand what you're saying, you stupid, dumb, fucking, uh, growing up in Cockney fucking England piece of fucking low-grade disposable, low-grade trash class asshole. She's a, yeah, you fucking, yeah, yeah, fucking, yeah, 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 fucking Nick Fuente, yeah, you fucking, you don't even understand, yeah, you fucking, yeah, yeah, I don't even fucking understand what the hell you're fucking saying, you dumb piece of shit. Yeah, he fucking goes. Yeah, he fucking yeah, yeah, he fucking yeah, 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 he fucking yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? All right, how about uh, I don't even know who to call on anymore. How about uh, uh, uh hey, dude, if you've already called, don't call back. All right, all right, let us continue here. Uh, we've got somebody who is anonymous. Radio graffiti. San Antonio and see my friend and he wants this radio show. I asked him, hey ghost, is everything really bigger in Texas? And he says, sure it is, let me show you. And you whipped it out. Needless to say, I was pretty impressed that Cripple could have to cost that big. Then we went to get dinner at the taco place. And I was surprised. There were more black people there than whites or Mexicans. And he said, What's the deal with black people? They're not black and they're not 
Oh, my God. Take that shit out. That, that is supposed to be some scuffed Jerry Seinfeld, for heaven's sake. Come on, man. Pow, 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 pow. Well, that stupid shit in the background. Big one tech support, radio graffiti. Thomas, this is Gary from the big one. Don't you try to lie to anyone about what happened to your computer. That PC came in as pristine as a five-star hotel. The only reason it broke was because during your 9-11 celebration, you got drunk as shit and pretended the box was a glory hole wall. You were very rough with it and came all over the circuits. Oh, and here's the real kicker. The package was so big, he thought it was Chris Christy was inside. Care to explain yourself, ghost? Get this fucking tart out. I mean, for fuck's sake. All right, look, I'm doing a video, dude. All right, y'all are pissing me off. I'm doing a fucking video. Anyway, let's continue here. Um, let's uh, go back to Radio Graffiti, folks. If you want to be a part of Radio Graffiti, all you have to do is give me a call right now, 667 667- 770-1015 and once the operator ditch starts talking all you got to do is push in the code 844-286 and you will be in queue to be a part of radio graffiti all right and wait a minute don't say that's my real voice all right i mean anything could be my real voice all right this could be my real voice or uh or this could be my real voice mr optimism a man that looks at life and an optimistic perspective. Every time I look at every living organism living life, it's a proof that this place is actually a gift in every context of the word, in every sense of the meaning. You can smell life, you can hear life, you can see life. You know what I mean? Or I can sound like fucking uh, Red Eyes Black Dragon. Hey, how you doing? It's Red Eyes Black Dragon here. And uh, I just want to let everybody know that uh, you know, this is my real voice, and, uh, you know, you know this, is, this is what I do. You know, I'm a proud bad dragon. That's what I, as a matter of fact, let me go ahead and, a uh, proud bad dragon, radio graffiti. Um, hey, why are you even calling me a hon? You did your shitty impression of me, you know? Yeah, yeah what's up there, proud bad dragon? How you doing, man? We're just fucking drinking here. How you doing, man? I sound drunk. Um, anyway, um, don't want to like that jersey whatever song from fucking Grateful Dead. You know, it really speaks to you. Oh, yeah, how does it speak to me there, proud bad dragon? How does it speak to me? Oh, it's easy. It's real easy. You smell cocaine. You know you smell cocaine. I mean, doesn't that Mexican kid sell, that sells candy apples give you that shit? N- hold on. First of all, no, he doesn't. All right? No, he fucking doesn't. All right? I don't do that shit. All right? Now, may, did I maybe once upon a time? I can't confirm or deny it, but if I did, it was pure Bolivian flake, and I was probably sniffing it off some chick's tits, all right? Oh, really? Yeah, I'm sure that's a confirmation. I could take that. And, you know, I think Cesar Lopez, that kid, I'm sure that's his name, he would confirm that. I'm pretty sure he knows that. All right. Yeah, you don't know the Mexican kid that sells candy apples on the corner that hooks me up with tobacco, all right? Don't even pretend. Don't even pretend that you know, all right? Jesus Christ. As a matter of fact, let me clean my pipe here. Let me get this let me get this crap out of here, all right? Once again, the ghost show is back. All right? We're fucking chilling like some insane villains doing some goddamn tomfoolery for a living. All right? That's what we're doing here. And this is not a crack pipe, asshole, all right? Uh, there, for all those people that think it's a fucking crack pipe, all right? That's for you, all right? Nasty chicken grease, corn oil, and cream beef, bitch. Jesus Christ. With a little bit of eggs in it, too, because I had some fucking some boiled eggs. How about that, huh? I'm just joking. Anyway, let me take a smoke here. We're going to get back to Radio Graffiti. Uh, we're in the midst of a new era of the ghost show, all right? And uh, make sure to let everybody know. Now, when the next show is, I have no idea. I don't know the schedule of the ghost show. I, I was going to do True Capitalist Radio every day. Obviously, I can't do that. If I'm doing fucking eight, nine-hour shows and shit, I can't fucking do it every day. So all I advise people to do is subscribe to whatever platform that you happen to be listening to this broadcast and uh, hopefully it'll give you a notification whenever yours truly is broadcasting, all right? All right. Anyway, let's go ahead and take a smoke here, all right? All right, gotta hold it in when it hit the brain, all right? All right, let's hold it in and hit the brain. Let me, let me get another caller here before... Hold on. 
Anyway, let's continue. How about the cracking man, Radio Graffiti? Hello, it's me, Ghost, and I just like to smoke crack. <laughs> no, just kidding, it's me. Good old proud bad dragon. And I have to prove it. Yep, that's right. I can take your confirmation, Ghost. Jesus Christ. Proud, proud bad dragon. Now you're starting to become a character, man. You're starting to become the ghost show cookie monster. I mean, you should sign off. Whenever you're going to fucking hang up from Radio Graffiti, you should be like, Oh, cookie, or some shit like that. That should be your trademark, dude. Oh, cookie, oh, I want a cook, or some shit like that. All right? That should be your internet moniker, for Christ's sake. I'm not even joking. If you're doing YouTube videos, you should be like, Oh, cookie, or some shit like that at your ending. I'm not even joking around. You'll probably make a lot more hits doing that. I'm not fucking joking. And I'll just send you an invoice when you do. Let's get to the next uh, Radio Graffiti caller. How about 539 Radio Graffiti? Hello? Yeah, what's up, dude? I, I, I understand that you support a quiz quiz thing. And I don't think that why, because I saw him uh, well in Columbia, uh, South Carolina. And I, I got to meet him. I shook his hand. He smelled like shit. Well, it's probably you and your upper lip. No offense, all right? I mean, I'm, I'm sure you probably smell like old cheese just by the sound of you, boy. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, all right? Uh, who do we got here? How about Michael Day Dog Lover, Radio Graffiti? This is Mike. I just wanted to say hi. What's going on? How are you doing? Uh, I'm not bad. What, are you a dog lover or something? What kind of a dog lover are you? I, I met this one girl that uh, she let a dog fuck her all the time. She said that the dog would come up and start humping her and she would Hello, get down HTTPS colon slash slash www.goquestions.org slash one third angels dot html. And it would sit there hump and 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 then come in her pussy. All right. Well, th that's a great story. I, I, we didn't really need to know that. I think that was fucking, that's foul and absurd, and uh, we really don't need to fucking hear that shit, all right? Jesus Christ. Uh, how We got somebody named Cervantes right here graffiti. Uh, hey, Jimmy. I hope you're not still trying to resurrect dead pedophiles or anything. I don't think that's a very good idea. Uh, Jimmy, uh, is anyone there? <laughs> What's going on? Hey, Ka, it's me, Michael Jackson. Uh, I don't like this. Oh, uh, why's the door locked? Jimmy, somebody let me out of here. Let's go to Neverland. Please stay away. No! Ka, close your eyes. No. Let my penis get. I don't want to be molested! Don't try to fight it. There ain't nothing that you can do. Please just leave me alone! Your ass is mine. Jimmy, shade anyone! Relax and spread those thighs. No. You gotta feel my meat. Ah. And it's deep inside your butthole. Share that BB ah. I'm gonna fuck, fuck you. Hey. All night. I didn't wipe today. It smells like I'm gonna ask you. It's so tight. I wish you wiped your ass today. Oh no! You fucking sick piece of goddamn fucking goddamn sick piece of fucking crap. Are you joking? God. God. Are you fucking joking, man? That's fucking disgusting, man. That's fucking disgusting. Who the fuck did that shit? Dude, that's fucking disgusting. Who the fuck? What sick mind? What demented fucking person? What broken soul had the time, effort, and energy to produce that disgusting shit, for Christ's sake? Oh, my God, dude. You... <laughs> We're in hell. You know what I mean? I honestly believe that this is hell. There's no way that this is the Garden of Eden. I'm not I'm not joking around. This is hell. All right? 
And it, it, it's just, it's, a, it's, 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 everything is suffering. Everything is so fucking suffering. You know, it's, it's just what it all is. Anyway, even though I'm being a little bit of a feels bad man here, I think everybody knows what time it is. It's time for more beer. <laughs> fucking get the shit out of here for Christ's sake. We're boozing here. And by the way, it is now the midnight hour. I should be talking like Wolfman Jack and shit. Hey, welcome to Wolfman Jack Midnight Hour. And what we're about to do here, ladies and gentlemen, is we're about to get into some love making. You know, love making music. The type of music that you want to go ahead and not pull out. And then 12 months later, well, nine months later, but nine months later, <laughs> never mind. I'm sorry. I'm getting a little tipsy. I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry, all right? I'm on my, what is this? Fucking two, four, six, uh, seventh beer. This is my seventh fucking beer here. All right, seventh beer. I haven't taken any goddamn uh, shots because if I'd be taking shots, I don't think I'd be uh, as boisterous and as energetic. Let's put it that way, all right? Uh, who do we got here? How about uh, Ghost Pippa Cheekbuster, Radio Graffiti? Dude, Cheekbuster, those workers are going to laugh at this Hyundai you drive. People always buy Dodge Chargers. That's the real car. Yeah, and says the guy who drives around in a gay little Prius. Ghost, you literally drive around in a soccer mom car. You're going to make fun of my vehicle. Every time I see someone in a Prius, they look like they're on their way to a bathhouse. Wait, wait, wait. Stop for one second. Why is that guy in a trench coat just staring at the Popeyes? Hold on a second, I think that guy is derwicking. Wait, then what is he doing here in a trench coat? Uh, no, no! Get out of here! Fucking Take that shit off! No, no! That's not funny! That's not fucking funny, man! I thought we were over that shit! I thought we were beyond that shit! I thought we moved past that shit! All right, you know what? For that, I'm doing another video, all right? I got to get to Bob Tom's fucking videos, all right, before he starts fucking crying and, you know, talking about how he's going to resurrect his dead cat so that, you know, I don't know, fucking, uh, it could bite my nuts or whatever the fuck he's doing. Anyway, let me get, uh, let me go ahead and uh, take a smoke here. All right. All right. All right. Hey, I, I got your dono, Viking Kyle. You just you went in in the middle of a radio graffiti call, and people hate that shit, you know? All right, let's continue here. Uh, I think we got Haywood on the horn. Haywood, radio graffiti. What's up, dude? What's up, man? How you doing, man? It's because of you that I'm on here for eight hours. Now, we are, we are literally on the eighth hour right now. Hey, what, hey, what, you there? Hey, fucking, he hung up. Did you just drop your phone in the toilet or something? Hey, what, what the, he just fucking hung up. Anyway, call back, hey, what, I don't know what happened there, man. Uh, let's go to, uh, Johnny Marr, Radio Graffiti. God damn it, Uncle. I'm about to start Notepad in three months, and it's taken an extremely large toll on my anxiety. Mizuko. Maybe you should relax and have a nice cup of some jasmine lean. Maybe if you got rid of that old ass haircut, you'd get some bitches on your dick. Better yet. Uncle, you don't understand! My future Tradcast waifu wouldn't fucking approve of my OnlyFans subscriptions! Renzuko, as I always say, a woman of the age of 13 has no word. My uncle in Christ! That is not the Catholic way! God gives his biggest battles to his strongest warriors. Your yeah, uncle in Christ? You are a porn addict. God strongest fucking soldier, you fucking fuck! Where's my jewel? My anxiety is fucking killing me. You are the type of to ask where the hoes at and be looking like some goofy ass. The minute the bitches pull up, look within yourself and ask why you have zero drip and zero bitches. If only this would have gotten some bitches on his dick, I could have helped you. Lean in the cow. All right. Uh, no, first of all, I know that was some silly bit, but I don't think that's untrue. I mean, I don't believe that women are that big of a feat 
no, no pun intended. And and by the way, when I say no big of a feed, I'm not talking about a foot fetish, you sick, twisted, fucking perverted pricks. I don't think scoring women is that hard. It's never has been, all right? Because look, women, they actually want men. They want men, but they want manly men. They don't want some dickless idiot who dresses up in cosplay as some anime character and goes to fucking Comic-Con and, and Anime-Con. That shit does not make men, make women wet at all, all right? Uh, playing video games all fucking day, that, that isn't going to make women turned on. And you see, that's what makes women faithful is the fact that they're, look at my guy, look at him there. Look at him, he's, he's a hard worker, he's a strong man, he's tough. You know, he takes care of me, he takes care of the house. I mean, you know, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's how you can get away with telling your woman, Hey, get in the kitchen and make me a fucking sandwich. That's when you can do that. Because she'll be like, you know what, okay. He's taking on all the stress. He's giving me a good life. And all I have to... I'll just go make him a sandwich. Let me just go make him a fucking sandwich, okay? Let me just go make him a fucking sandwich right now. And I'll make it very good. Uh, do you want white or wheat bread? You know I only eat white, bitch! Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and get uh, white, alright? Because white is right. Anyway, let's continue here. I'm sorry. I, I know I'm going in off keister here. Uh, how about uh, the Fifth Collective, by the way? I was supposed to call on the Fifth Collective, but... Uh, the Fifth Collective Radio Graffiti. Sorry about that, dude. Uh, uh, hey, uh. Good evening, everyone, and welcome back to your Fifth Collective News Network. I'm Keith Relford. Over Labor Day weekend, there were shots fired along the West Indian Day Carnival Parade Route in Brooklyn, New York. Joining me tonight is criminal psychologist Jenneth McBride as we review newly released audio of Thomas Ghost Albin, who appeared to be the gunman. Jenneth? Thank you for having me on, Keith. Jenneth, you claim Ghost may actually suffer from split personality disorder. Is this correct? Yes, Keith. If you listen to the audio sample you'll have, you will see that Ghost is the doc of the personality of what he believes to be a millennial. Let's take a listen, but I must warn our listeners, this will be disturbing to some. Hi. How are you doing? Yo, what am I, brother, from another mother? Yes, I'm a millennial, and uh, I still live with my mother, even though I'm 32. Uh, hey, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Are you tripping on something, dog? You look like you're about 70s, 80 years old. Uh, unfortunately, I don't know what you're talking about, because I'm a millennial. And I only look at what's going on with anime. I only look at what's going on with my waifu. Uh, I only care about things that are having to do with cosplay. Oh, okay? man. Oh, man. Hey, Tyrone, come over here and get a load of this to albino. That, that's triggering me right now, okay? That racism that this guy just did, what? it's triggering me. And I'm black. I'm getting a little social anxiety. I'm black. I'm allowed to say I'm that. out of my safe space. I, I, I don't. I am not used to toxic, vulgar, racist language like that. I'm whoa, getting. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm getting hey, a little what, bit. What do you got there? What do you got there? Please excuse me. I'm getting a little anxiety. He said the N word. Jenneth, would you mind explaining to our listeners why Ghost pretended to be a millennial? While it's certainly too early to say for certain, given what we know about his past, I believe Ghost sought out a younger persona to try to relive and correct his younger years. We know that Ghost was physically and emotionally abused as a child by his alcoholic dad and promiscuous grainy, and it's my belief this led him to have a very reckless in adulthood once he was kicked out of a house and abandoned at age 18. You can tell that when Ghost heard the racial slur, he became immediately distraught, most likely at the prospect of being reminded of the racism that occurred in his youth, and by extension the abuses he suffered during that time period in his life. Jenneth, that's all the time we have for today, but thank you again for joining us and giving us your professional input. For those of you at home, we'll give you up-to-date coverage as new details develop. As always, I'm Keith Relford. Stay safe, everyone. You fucking piece of shit! Turn that shit off! Turn that shit off! Fucking shoot the fucking ass off! Oh. Oh. Damn it! All right.
right, man. I think I'm done with this fucking shit, dude. I'm not even fucking kidding around, man. I think I'm done with this fucking crap. I'm even drinking alcohol, and I can't pallet this garbage. I'm drinking alcohol, and I can't pallet this fucking shit. Uh, Ghost drank bleach, radio graffiti. Shout out to everyone in chat. And Nick my go so much email fucking groomed me. All the IC members groomed me, what the fuck? If you wanna see some chance fly, kill on and make that him, but thank the rage, yeah, make sure that he molds and see if he's on you, like an incel, I can't get any titties, yeah. Be the focus of attention, be the troll that everyone must mention, come out of the closet, it's your time, cause tonight is the night for every troll to see, it's a you know that this is where you gotta be It must be a destined sense Channel And you believe that this is what you've waited for And it's you that they all adore So baby now you feel like number one Trolling ghosts for everyone Letting out your incel rage The hottest weave that Ghost wide, now you feel like number one. Trolling ghost for everyone. Letting out your artist rage of as tendies they ever. <coughs> Hear the kids I wave around you. Big dildos and homosexuals around you Every brown noser wants a piece of you You're the artist in the screaming room chipping out It's a journal You know that this is where you gotta be It must be a destiny to oh, oh, you know, Shut this fucking stupid fucking helmet boy. Fucking goddamn stupid fucking son of a bitch ah. All right, dude, I think I'm getting- get the shit out of here. Fucking shit out of here! I'm fucking tired of this shit, dude. I really- I'm, I'm getting really fucking tired, huh? I, how long have I been on here? I've been on here for eight hours and going on 15 fucking minutes over here. And this is all I've been taking, fucking non-stop. A ghost show is back, and this is what I've been taking non-fucking-stop. All right? You would think that maybe some of you have a little bit of appreciation or some shit. Jesus Christ, look at all these fucking beers I got here. You see, I'm fucking drinking thanks to Haywood! Anyway, I think everybody out there knows what time it is, right? You all know what time it is. It's time for more beer! That's what the fuck time it is, dude. Get the fucking shit out of here. It's fucking... You see, nobody can drink like old ghosts, all right? If you're keeping up with me, you're probably going to get alcohol poisoned. I have a seasoned liver. All right, I'm a professional drinker, so I know what I'm doing, all right? I'm a professional drinker up in here, all right? And I'm more professional than only use me blade, because look at me, I'm fucking drinking. I've been up here for fucking eight hours, for Christ's sake, all right? Who does that? Who does it? Oh, dude, I'm not an alcoholic, all right? All you people that are saying, oh, gosh, you're a little bit of an alcoholic. I am not an alcoholic. I'm a connoisseur. There's a big difference, okay? Because I actually appreciate all the alcohol that I consume. All right, I'm not just fucking consuming alcohol for the sake of, oh man, I want to get fucked up. I'm consuming it because I appreciate the flavor and the taste, you know, and the nuances. You know what I mean? I mean, the, uh, you guys wouldn't understand that, all right? You guys wouldn't understand that. You people buy off the fucking well at a bar, all right? I buy off the premium top shelf. All right? You guys don't understand that. All right? You guys would get fucking rot gut te tequila as opposed to getting a uh, Anejo, you know, tequila. I'm just saying, Anejo is the best tequila that you can buy. You know, it's aged two years. You can't age, by the way, a tequila more than two years or it'll taste rancid. So that's why there's a, a difference. There's Anejo, which is aged two years, and Reposado, which is aged one year, which ain't bad either. It's a hell of a lot better than Jose Cuervo Gold, I'll tell you that. Anyway, cheers to everybody out there. Let me go ahead and take some drinks here. 
All right, but anyway, I think we got Ghosto. You there, Ghosto? Hey, Ghosto, you there? Ghosto Majima. Hello? Yeah, what up, dude? Hey, how's it going, bud? How's it going, man? All right, do we got Helmet Boy? <laughs> Helmet Boy, you there? How could you do this to me, Ghosto? You get anal sausages on there all, here also. He's in here. He's waiting. He's waiting. And get Enigma on here. All three of these motherfuckers, they did some terrible shit to me as a kid. I had enough. Okay, hold get on. Get him so, in here. I'm so, on. Play the whole thing. Yeah, somebody you, you dropped you the fifty dollar bill. Slash YouTube dot B slash Quake. Hold on. Some, somebody dropped a fifty dollar bill too soon. Thank you very much, man. All right. <laughs> All right, hold on. We know about where, where, everything. Where is, uh, I, I don't see, anal, hold on, anal sausages, you there? Yo, what's going on, guys? Well, it's not anal sausages, that's just some fucking juice Hey, don't hate on me, I'm just chilling, man. What's no, going? no, listen, you're the one that did all this because you leaked that ghost stoke room to me. And I'm going to be honest, that's no, the truth. No, you're you want to shut your mouth. It was ghost oil, but it was also anal sausages and enigma. Thank you, man. All right, all right. I'm take. I'm taking them off. All right. I'm no, taking no, them no, off. No, 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 no. I all took. Right. I took them off. All right. Hold on. How about uh, how about the real West Coast capitalist? Are you there? Hey, what's going on? We need your guidance on this. Uh, okay, anal sausages should be on this phone. Hey, fuck the hell Air, what air the fuck is your major malfunction, numbnuts? Well, yeah, dude, I'm having a fucking panic attack. You can't be doing this to me. You can't handle sausages. Oh, yeah, you're having just, a fucking panic attack, He's always making area code. Go get his area code. Go, go. I think you know it by heart. Mike, why are you having a fucking panic attack all of a sudden? Because I was like, wrong! Your if I could just clear up something real quick about the grooming allegations, they're all real. Um, oh, yeah, now you're gonna admit it, you fucking weirdo. Um, and, and yeah, I'm just as guilty as the others, but uh, I would like to point out that some people were going a little too hard. Um, we had one person, uh, he, he might know him, his name is Ace Sausages, uh, all, right. Would, um, all right, you know what, y'all are playing a weird fucking bit, and I don't really like it, and I'll be honest with you, that, I don't know where y'all are going with that. Hey, Wood, uh, Radio Graffiti, what do you think about this shit? Wait, wait, what? I, dude, I didn't catch that. Hey, what do you think about all this? I didn't hear any of that. I just got back my fucking phone online. I was getting my shit ready for work, and I just got it back up and running, man. What did I miss out on? I don't know. Uh, Ghost Omajima is going at anal sausages, and uh, it's that uh, drama. Nah, dude. They've, they've been going at each other in the dome and the IC and all that shit for a minute, man. It's been mostly in the dome, but it's... Yeah, it's whatever. I want to stay out of that shit, you know. I kind of want to be friendly with people now. I've seen everybody they got some kind of hater attached to them. The people have parasitic relationships, and uh, yeah, I don't, I don't want a part of that, you know. It's cool knowing people, but I don't, I don't want, you know, yeah, yeah, a love hate relationship. Yeah, I know you. I know what you mean, man. And, and you know, I don't like this drama, you know, coming along, uh, you know, and it's being aired out here on the show. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I know what you mean, man. Um, I don't know about your minimalist perspective, though. What do you mean, my minimalist perspective? I, that, that that pertains to how I like things in you know certain rooms of interior decorating. Yeah, but that doesn't make a house a home, does it? Does uh, it, it? Yeah, it does to me. Are you kidding me? I love my place. Are you fucking joking me? Home is where the heart is. This is my favorite place to be is my home. Do you have any family photos hanging on the wall? Do you have any shit like that? Uh, no, I think family photos are just uh, pretentious attempts at showing other people that enter your home that y'all are, you know, happy when, you know, 
If y'all were a happy family, you wouldn't have to show it on showing old memories to everybody else that happens to grace your fucking house. You know what I mean? You don't see the bottom. Hold on, you're cutting in oh, and out. Like, you're cutting in and out, dude. What'd you say? You don't see them as reminders that, like, every time you see them, they remind you of that event, or they remind you of when that happened. No, like no, because I remember it, all right, because it's in my head. And if it really meant something to me, I would always have it in my recollection. And if I really, truly wanted to think about it or if it impacted me, I would uh, I would think about it. That's how it, that's how it goes, you know what I mean? Do you, do, you even, do you have a bookshelf at all? <laughs> yeah, I have a fucking library. Yeah, I have, I have more than a bookshelf. Uh, you, you got a library, huh? Yeah, well, you know, I have a, a you know su a substantial amount of books. Let's put it that way, and, and you know, I display them accordingly. Is it minimalist? <laughs> well, not in. The, it depends on what room you're talking about, Haywood. All right, I'm a minimalist. Is your, is, is, is your refrigerator minimalist? What does that mean? <laughs> uh, okay. All right. Uh, well, all right. Well, we'll talk yeah. to you later, Haywood. Thank you very much. I hate a fucking asshole that laughs at his own jokes. All right. Reminds me of Medicare for Christ's sake. Hey, you know, fucking, you know, the gun, to, you know, you know, enemy. <laughs> I hate fuckers that laugh at their own jokes, dude. Makes me fucking want to puke. Uh, let's see. Who else do we have here? Uh, how about, uh, is this anal sausages, radio graffiti? What's up, Gus? What's up, dude? Oh, not shit, man. Just hanging out and getting drunk. Cause, uh, dude, what's up with all this drama, know, dude? People are mad that, uh, you know, I don't give a shit about them fucking doxing me. All right, look, look, hold that's, on, that's hold on. Can, can I bring on at least uh, Ghosto? Because I, I gotta, I gotta ask. No, you. fuck that retard. I don't want, I don't want to hear from Scuff Tank Hill. You don't want to hear from me? Go, Why? No, no, I'm hold a good on. Hold boy. on, no, no, because no, no. you're a fucking retard, dude. Hold on, hold on. I'm a retard. Ghosto, Why am I retard? Ghosto, Ghosto. Because you're the one, you're the one sending me pizzas, you dumb fuck. You're the one. I'm that... not sending you pizzas. <laughs> yeah, I you are. A single pizza. Okay. Yep, you're not Cali do the Albert. Got that? Okay. I mean, the people got that got send you are the ones that are proud to it. They're proud to admit it. You're, so. you're, you're such a cheap bastard that you can't even pay for the pizzas you're sending me. That's how much of a loser well, you I? are, dude. How, how, would, is, how, is your, how is your hotel, how is your hotel job going? No. How is the hotel job no, going? Let's, let's not, not get also, personal. It's going pretty good. Let's, hang on. Can I say something, Ghost, real quick? Yeah, go ahead, dude. So, I want to know why he's allowed to call, like, all these hotels in Tennessee to try and find me, but the second I, like, find out where he's at, he's butt hurt to hell and back. Uh, anal sausages? Do yeah. you want to, you, you know, not respond? No, I'm not butt hurt. I'm actually laughing. You're, you're pathetic, dude. You're, you you're fucking. You're fucking hurt, doing dude. my. You're doing my. You're doing the job that I did when I turned 18, and you're like a 40 year old man. You're pathetic. It's sad. And uh, and you can't you, you can't even pay station. for the. You can't even. I, I actually actually I don't work anywhere anymore. I'm unemployed. Bang bang, motherfucker! Job. I got I got unemployment and food stamps coming in. I'm two one three two point yeah, the, thank thank you for uh, thank you for segueing me into that. Guys? By the way, hold on, hold I on. I do not. Hold on. I do no Anal longer sausages. have a job, and I am fucking out here collecting unemployment, and, and, food stamps. Thank Anal you sausages. for segueing into hold, that. Hold on, are you? Are, hold on, hold on, whoa, 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 whoa. Are you, are you <laughs> saying that they got you fired from your job, dude? No, I didn't. I didn't get fired. My job literally closed down. Like the the place of business literally shut down, so I I'm collecting unemployment and food stamps now. Why are y'all doing this to each other, dude? Seriously, why, why is that something to they're, they have, they're, 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 mad, they're mad at me because I don't give them reactions. So this is Ghost of Mazila being a pathetic retard. Hey hey buddy, go back to your fucking night shift job at a hotel where you should be working. 
You should be at work right now, remember? You worked night shift at a hotel. You're at work. You get off work the fucking phone. Get, out, get, get off the phone. Why are you so mad right now, dude? Calm down. I'm not We're mad. I'm laughing. I'm, I'm laughing at you. I'm not mad. I'm <laughs> laughing. Why, did, calm down. Calm down, buddy. It's okay. <laughs> this isn't even calm right, down. Well, I'm let's, laughing let's, at you, you retard. You're like I'm laughing at you, you retard. <laughs> I, I know you're like Jesus really Jesus fucking upset. Christ, dude, you're retarded. I know you're Holy really shit. upset because, like, your wife fake features. You're retarded. Shit. Holy like, shit, dude. Go so, go also, so. Uh, you're you're, your your you're, you're, you're literally <laughs> retarded. You're you're literally okay. retarded. Yeah. You're talking yeah, about yeah, me like, like I'm yeah. upset. And I'm <laughs> sitting here drinking and having a good time, my <laughs> guy. Fucking going on here? What's this all about? The, the oh Coast Jesus! Fuck. Why, why did Why did you bring West Coast in here, Ghost? Now, now we're gonna have a bad time because West yeah. Coast. Yeah, I'm like your dirty <laughs> douche rag of a single Shut whore. Up, West Coast. I just end up a left or Shut up, West Coast. On her face. Shut and up, West Coast. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. You let him talk. You know what? You, you shut up too. Shut you fucking hotel night manager. You fucking. On each other's fucking cocks for no fucking reason. You're, like <laughs> You're like 40 years old doing the same job that I did when I was 18. Shut up. How about you can go and get uh, yourself a fucking job? Hey, hey shut up, Ken. I don't know what the fuck to you. Get yourself a fucking so job, ain't no sauce, just you fucking unemployed slacker. I, I, I have a job. I have a job. Or at least I did. Uh, up until yesterday. <laughs> you guys are a fucking laugh. All I gotta say this to you, you fucking like a loving piece of shit. Shut up, you I fucking cup on. You're a cup in your damn time. Deal with your fucking wife. You wonder why? This ain't no such as Shut up, West you Coast. You're perpetually single. Eat a dick, dude. You wish you had a wife. <laughs> well, how about you, you better be the fucking banging like a goddamn dog <laughs> ain't no <laughs> sauce. <laughs> yeah, you gotta shut that dog up, dude. Let it outside and stop abusing it. Also, get I cup yeah, and Olive Boy in here. Yeah, take that bitch outside. Shut the fuck up, Gusto. You're really tired of this. Take the dog outside. Let him take whoa, 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 whoa. Let's do something about it. My dog's barking it. because you're retarded and you just keep yelling. No, I think they're picking up on your back eyes, dude. All right, hold on just he a was second. Hold up on. Until you retard hold on. Screaming. We got uh, Helmet Boy. You there, Helmet Boy? You know what you all did to me, right? So these two, they ran a trolling group back in 2016 with this guy named Eric Page, and it was called the Hitler Stash Mafia. And they tried to fucking, like, they were sending me their balls and shit. Now listen, Enigma's name is... Alright, dude, we don't... Calm down. Everybody's doxing! <laughs> Why is everybody doxing, dude? What the fuck is going on in the Thunderdome that I am not seeing? There's some fucking secret underground fucking war amongst people in the Thunderdome. What the fuck? Can you get Icup in here? Who the fuck is I? I, I, I see you, P. What the fuck? Hi. How you been? Who are the fuck? Who, who are you? Uh, you, you literally sound... All right, never mind. I, fuck this guy. You want you want me to bring this fucking guy on? You know what, Ghosto? I hope Anal Sauce now. All right, fucking asshole. Make it. Uh, he won't find me. This is this is he who you this is who you're commiserating with. Fucking stupid idiots like this. Give me a fucking break. He tried, man. Remember, he tried calling every. He had purple juice. He and Enigma kept like giving purple juice numbers for like all these hotels I supposedly worked at. Well, I don't think that's right. Me. I don't think that's right. But dude, I mean. Look at the people you hang around. This fucking ICUP idiot, fucking wild yeah, Randy. It, I mean, fucking, fucking low-grade disposable road trash that should be fucking eliminated in Operation Meat Shield, for fuck's sake, dude. And hold on. you, okay, you I don't hold, know why I get freaking fat jokes. Hold on. Purple Juice, you there? All right, all right, all right. Okay, I was bored. And, you know, Sauce and I kind of were bored, too. I mean, I was drunk myself, and I... 
thought, hey, I'm gonna call it anal. I meant not anal sausage. Go to Majima for fun, and it kind of turned into a fail. Okay, so is that is that the crux of why you're a part of this whole situation? I was just doing it for fun because I just wanted to prank call some people for fun and also prank call Ghost of Majima just for the hell of it. So you know, hey. so you know, Ghosto. Not no, but I just know he works as a. Yeah, we know each other. Don't don't lie, purple. Don't oh, no, lie. No, I, I, I babysat you. you. In person, I've never seen you in person. Come on. You know, I, I literally knew you since you were knee high to a grasshopper. Purple juice. Uh, didn't Ghosto say that you live in like a caboose somewhere or something? Yeah, yeah. He, no, he, anal he, sausages. Oh, it was anal sausages. He, he that lived. He lived in a caboose. I'm, I'm mad. My bad. Yeah. Oh, you're good. Yeah, my caboose is still going good. <laughs> so it's true. Like, you have, like, like some kind of train car caboose and that, like, that's your dwelling? Yep. Oh, my God. Are you, are you <laughs> kidding me? Don't, 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 look, he keeps his stuff in a bindle, okay? He goes on the tracks. Uh, he's a working man, all right? I work also. And I do a lot. Of, I'm in, I'm actually trying to look into getting back into some a different type of electrician work. All right. Well, you know, I think I, after hearing all this shit, I think everybody out there knows what time it is, man. It's fucking time for it's time more to beer. It's time yeah, more beer. I don't know. I think I'd live in a caboose for a little bit. Right? That sounds like an Airbnb time for about a month or two, right? I don't know. I, I guarantee you fucking white people. I guarantee you fucking white people have tiny homes out of cabooses. I mean, I know a guy that can turn a decent-sized freaking RV into a nice fucking place. I think somebody can make a caboose into a nice chill pad. I would, personally. Oh, shit. Look at all these fucking beers Oh, Helmet Boy wants back in, Ghost. Ah, uh, dude, that's enough uh, of Helmet Boy, and that's enough of that. To be honest with you, that's enough of all this crap, all right? All right, let's get this shit right. out of here, man. All right, Anal Sausages is already fucking... He already hung up, so... He didn't want to have anything to do with that. All right. Look, I'm sorry, everybody, that it, we, we turned into that capacity. Uh, but, you know, it, this is what happens, you know, when you have, like, a fucking community of trolls, dude. I mean, they're fucking, they're vicious. You know what I mean? They're fucking, they're, they're vicious, for Christ's sake. Uh, we got another uh, Lambo subordinate video here. So let's go ahead and get to Lambo subordinate, and then we'll get back to Radio Graffiti. And you said... Uh,